everyone welcome back to my channel this is your girl lady tevo t back with another video this is a little video i'm gonna do for all signs okay i wanted to find out how you guys is ex um is feeling about you and what actions are they going to take towards you i'm going to go right down the line right here <clears throat> excuse me guys i'm going to start off with the zodiac sign of aries here so the first card represents um how their partner is feeling how their ex-partner is feeling about them and for aries we have the queen of wands okay so could be still some attraction within this um relationship here let's see what the action that um that your ex will be taking and whether or not he's going to be he or she is going to be getting back with you here we have the Ace of Swords. So for some of my Aries, I feel like your ex do still have passion for you here with this Queen of Wands, okay? This could also be your energy as well. Um, but nonetheless, I feel like you guys, um, your ex definitely has passion for you and definitely feel like rekindling um, a flame here with this Ace of Swords, wanting to bring clarity to a situation, okay? And some of you guys could also, some of you Aries could also be dealing with um, an air sign, okay? So let's move on to the next um, sign. We have the Zodiac sign of Taurus here, okay? So let's figure out um, the first card is how your ex feels about you, Taurus. We have the Page of Wands. So, um, some of you guys could also be dealing with a fire sign, but nonetheless, it could be any sign. Um, I feel like this person maybe wants to bring you, maybe wants to get in touch with you here with this, um, Page of Wands energy. Um, wanting to send you some type of message here. Um, okay, so let's find out what the action is and whether this person, um, wants to get back with you yeah no doubt we got the ace of cups some of you guys could be dealing with the water sign okay um but nonetheless i feel like this person wants to reach out to you here with this page of wands energy okay they could be still thinking about you as well and wanting to offer up this um love here okay let's move on okay we have um next for gemini here um and guys guys i'm gonna um definitely i'm gonna try to timestamp this video here so you guys you know won't have to wait through the whole video all right so next we have gemini this is the ten of wands so this could be um your partner <clears throat> feeling well your ex your ex okay feeling very burdened here with the relationship or was feeling heavy burdened with the relationship okay let's figure out the action we have the chariot some of you guys could be dealing with the cancer um i feel like it may be a struggle for your for your ex to want to come back here um with the ten of wands i feel like they may have let this heavy burden go here maybe the heavy burden was you guys <clears throat> i'm sorry but that's just the way I, that i feel here um and i feel like they may be um not willing to give this relationship a second chance i feel like it was too much for them here with the son of wands okay and how they felt about the relationship and i feel like they had to move on from it okay next we have cancer Let's see the four of pentacles so um maybe your ex feels like they maybe could be still holding on to some type of hope here um, with this four of pentacles let's see what type of action they're going to take we have the queen of cups some of you guys could have been dealing with the water sign cancer pisces scorpio okay um such as yourself <laughs> all right um they may still have love for you okay or someone could be your your uh, ex could be holding on to some type of um love for you here still the next time we have is leo so we have the star card okay your ex um you could be dealing with an aquarius okay um your ex leos def uh they're trying to gain some type of hope here with this star card is what i'm getting okay let's take the action to uh so so some of them could be indecisive here about giving you another chance or giving this relationship a second chance okay um i really feel like this person is confused here with the two of swords all right and they really don't know which way they want to go okay so let's just leave it at that because you know the feelings that they have for you they may be still hoping <clears throat> here with the star card maybe wondering what it would be like here but they're still indecisive on their actions here or um their communication here is what i'm getting so nonetheless let's move on to virgo okay we have the six of swords okay so i feel like um your your pet your um ex virgo 
<clears throat> may be wanting to come forward okay let's see the action okay we have the page of swords okay so i'm feeling like because the swords are all about the thoughts okay so they may be wanting to come forward but i feel like the action that they're taking they're very sneaky and doing so here with the page of swords they could be watching you as well um and being sneaky here but nonetheless wanting to come forward here with the six of swords so it's up to you next we have the libra my libras Alright, guys could be dealing with an earth sign or a Virgo here. Um, I feel like the way that <clears throat> Libras, the, guys, the way your ex is feeling, I feel like maybe um, it's going to take a long time for them to come around and give you this stable commitment that you guys may want here with this um, Knight of Pentacles energy. Let's see the action. Yeah, we have the Knights of Wands. You could be dealing with the fire sign as well. I see this player. I mean, as a player. <laughs> yeah, they are They are players, okay? Um, with this Knight of Wands energy, <clears throat> I feel like this person is going to take them a long time to give you some type of commitment here because they're still... Um, uh, living their life here with this uh, Knight of Wands energy, they still um, <clears throat> are very much having fun here, um, not wanting to commit here to a situation, okay? So it may be a long time for your ex to come back, if some of you may want your ex to come back, it may be a long time. It may be a long time before they commit to you here is what I'm getting, all right? Because of their play of ways with this Knight of Wands energy. Anyway, let's move on. Next, we have the Scorpio, my Scorpios, okay? Your ex <clears throat> could be dealing with the, with the um, um, an air sign here. Sorry, guys. With this um, Knight of Swords energy. I feel like um, this person uh, may be wanting to rush in here with this Knight of Swords energy, very chaotic here. They could be still thinking about you here. Let's see the action. Okay, we have the five of pentacles. So I feel like this X um, <clears throat> that you guys have, I feel like Scorpios. I'm talking Scorpios. For the X's that you guys have, I feel like they may be wanting to come back here with this night of uh, swords energy very chaotic here I feel like for some of you for some of them you had left them out in the cold here with this five of Pentacles okay and um maybe they want to come back to kind of like uh kind of like for some type of revenge here so you may be uh, wanting to be careful as well here you may have put it on them <laughs> all right and now they're upset because you put them out in the cold and um so with this person coming with this type of energy i would kind of think twice before i uh give this person a chance here all right <clears throat> so for some of you if you do want to revisit your past with this person and this type of energy you may want to um be careful okay Let's move on. The next time we have a Sagittarius here. Let's see. We have the Nine of Swords. So I feel like your partner may be um, worried or maybe feeling down about you here. You may have broken a few hearts here with this Nine of Wands energy because this is the way that your partner feels about you. So um, they may be worried, having a lot of anxiety here. Or um, kind of like hurting over something or something that happened within their relationship here is what I'm getting, okay? And let's see the action that they're going to take. Yeah, we have the Five of Cups. This person may be brokenhearted from you guys, okay? You may have broken a few hearts is what I'm getting here. And they could be mourning over this loss, over over losing you here is what I'm getting. Um, I feel like uh, if you're trying to get back with this person, I think it's maybe best for you to give this person some time to heal is what I'm getting, all right? Let's move on. The next um, sign is Capricorn here. We have the um, Knights of Cups. You could be dealing with the um, water sign here. Uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. For some of you um, Capricorns, okay? Um, so this person definitely thinking about you here with this um, Knight of Cups energy wanting to offer you some type of uh, emotions here. Okay, so the action they're going to take, we have the tower, okay? Um, so they may be going through some type of tower moment or the relationship probably ended on bad terms, okay? So this person may be thinking twice about coming back, okay, to you because of this tower moment. I don't know what happened, but uh, whatever happened... I guess it's not stopping this person because they still have feelings for you. But whatever that happened, I feel like um, it was a shakeup of the situation. So I'm really not feeling. Let me put one more card on here. Yeah, we have the Seven of Wands. So <clears throat> it may be this person may be um, still having emotional feelings for you guys, but I feel like they may um, be scared to 
jump into a relationship with you or come back to you only because with the seven of wands i feel like they had to stand up for the relationship here um they may have been <clears throat> challenged by um a lot of people within a relationship that may have caused this relationship to crumble here is what i'm getting so anyway nonetheless let's move on the next time we have is aquarius okay we have the uh queen of swords this is an air sign here um okay so i feel like aquarius uh this person may be acting cold towards you um maybe maybe uh, having their guard up towards you or the way that they feel about you here. Let's see the action. Okay, you could be dealing with an um water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay, but nonetheless, let me see the action. They may be wanting to give this relationship another chance, but um, <clears throat> they may be kind of like trying to figure out how you're going to approach the situation here. Being as though the Queen of Swords is here with her guard up. Okay, um, someone could be trying to figure out what else this person can offer them besides emotions okay um and your ex may be kind of sort of 50 50 about coming back here let's put one more card on here I have the three of wands okay so i feel like for the for the most part a lot of you a lot of you guys the ex are definitely waiting here they could be waiting for you to make some some type of move here all right, but they no nonetheless, I feel like they still have love for you here. Anyway, let's move on to the last one. We have Pisces. Okay, we have the Seven of Pentacles. So your ex may be feeling, may be feeling just like trying to invest in something, but the overall energy I'm getting from this card is waiting here. Let's see the action that they're taking. Okay, so I feel like um, for a lot of you Pisces, your ex definitely could be waiting around for some type of um, uh, relationship here, some type of commitment that they want to give to you or that you want to give to them, vice versa, okay? Um, I feel like it may be up to you to whether you uh, want to give this person a chance. You could be also dealing with the Taurus here, all right? So, um, I guess it's just up to you guys whether you want to <clears throat> um, revisit this past with this ex here. But definitely, no doubt, with the hyphen, I feel like this person <clears throat> do want to give you some type of um, commitment within a relationship, okay? All right, I appreciate you guys for watching. If this message resonates with any one of your signs, please like, share, and subscribe, and I will definitely holler back at you in the next video. All right, have a great night. Bye-bye.